last full measure, red carpet screening at SCAD. We're ready to go and see this movie. It's supposed to be a red carpet screening. I don't see a red carpet. Just see. Lots of trembling right now because it's freezing cold. But I'm hoping that this is going to be a good show. I'm excited. So I expected it to be a very long line because they're like, get there early, red carpet screening. And if you know me, I'm usually like a on time kind of person, not a really early person. But I am super early. They told me to come back at six. So I'm like another hour. <laughs> very early, very early. So yeah, we're gonna come back and maybe the red carpet will be out by then. That'll be exciting. And Samuel L. Jackson, are you excited to meet him? Oh my goodness. I don't know if we're going to meet him, actually. Oh, like... If I meet him, I'm like, freak out. <laughs> we'll just see him. Visualize him. He'll speak in the same room as us. That's pretty cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright, now there's a line. But just so everyone knows, we were first in line. <laughs> we were the first ones. that we're gathered today on Martin Luther King Day to celebrate another great American hero, William Pittsburgh. The journey to see uh, William Pittsburgh's Medal of Honor took 34 years for the men of Charlie Company, the men soldiers in Pittsburgh's Benoit Union, the Benoit Eagles. And it took 20 years to make this film and be here in this moment. Um, when the director, Todd Robinson, and myself first started working on this film, we obviously had no idea it would take this long to get it made. Um, we also didn't know we'd be transformed by the experience of making it. The men we met, these brave men, uh, become family with us, and they're really incredible people. Well, I'm gonna tell you, to start off with, what a distinct honor it is for me to be up here uh, representing the Pararescue Courier Cur Field community. Uh, what an honor it was to work with all of these actors that were involved that just worked their bones off for it. And the sweat that you see on these soldiers in that this movie is not somebody running around with a spray bottle spraying them. They worked real hard to make this come off really well. I can't say enough about them to tell you how great the movie is. I've seen it. You're going to love it. I love it. We took it to the Pararescue School on August 23rd. The whole new class that graduated and all the veterans that were there of pararescue active duty and retired love this movie so that's all i got to say thank you very much and i'm going to introduce the man who made all this happen mr todd Rob. ladies and gentlemen thank you for coming to all of our veterans uh, and our active military we made this film for you and your families we hope you enjoy it. We'll see you after. God bless. Before you go, say goodnight to the survivors and veterans of Operation Avalanche. Gentlemen, please stand up. Thank you, everyone.
everyone drives that home, home safe. You know what I mean? <laughs> So I just left the screening. It was a wonderful movie. You really should go see The Last Measure. Wonderful story being told there and stories that we don't always get to hear about our war heroes. I'm usually not a big war movie person, but I really enjoyed this movie. It's definitely a must see. And I got to meet Samuel L. Jackson. Being in the cold was very much worth it. Um, I got to meet him on the red carpet, which was fun, and we even got to take a little selfie. So, very pleased with this screening. Thank you, SCAD, for inviting me out. Such a wonderful time, and I look forward to future events.